Hello there, it's me, Kimberly Gosney from makingheadway.us. And in today's quick tech tutorial, I wanted to walk you through how to embed a YouTube video from your channel onto your WordPress website and center it. I get asked this all the time. How do I take my YouTube videos and pop them on my website? So let's do it. Right now, I'm gonna go ahead and go to my channel and grab one of my recent videos. So I'm just going to look down my playlist. I'm just going to grab this one. When you get to the video you want to embed on your site, you're just going to click on the title of it. That is going to bring you up to the um, video itself. Sorry, I had to pause myself. And what you want to do is come down to you get to this little section where it says share. So you're going to click on the word share and then you're going to click on the word embed because we're going to embed it into our website's pages. Next part here is to click the Show More button. When you click the Show More, it's going to bring up some secret options that are available to you. I like to uncheck Show Suggested Videos when the video finishes. That way it doesn't show people any other crazy random videos at the end of your video. Now, you can adjust the size to a custom size if you'd like. If you do, 600 pixels wide by 400 pixels tall seems to work really great on websites that have a sidebar on the side. But you might have to play around with that setting. And you can always change this on the WordPress page too. So I'm just going to, for right now, put it back to the default size that it was on. Now you're going to come back up here to this little top chunk, copy all of this, and you're going to paste this on your website. So now we're done with the YouTube part, let's hop over to the website. Here I am on makingheadway.us and I've created a new post. And this is going to be where I would pop in my video. So I've added my new post and now all I'm going to do is click the text button. That way I'm on the text editor version of WordPress and not on the visual where you write the words. So that part's super important. Once again, it's just this word text right over here on the right. Now I'm just going to paste in my code. And you'll see that it has the sizing as width and height. You can experiment with this. Um, usually 600 by 400 works pretty good for me, but you can always check it and make it a little bit smaller, or a little bit taller, a little less wide if you see black around the edges of your video. Now for the fun part, we want to center this video on the page. You don't have to do this step, but if you like your videos in the middle of your content section on your website, this will really help you out. All you're going to do is come right over here to the very front part right beside for where it has an arrow and says iframe. In this little spot, you're going to do an arrow, the word center, followed by another arrow. And then you're going to come all the way down to the end of all of that gobbledygook coding, and you're going to do the same thing but with one little twist. We're going to do our arrow and a forward slash, followed by the word center, then another arrow. So that has opened our command technically and closed our command down at the bottom. So if we click on visual now, we're not going to see a whole ton of much. We're just going to see a box in the center of our page. And that is absolutely perfect. So now what we're going to do is hit publish so we can take a peek and see this actually centered on your site. And then this way, once you publish it and take a peek, you can see if you need to make any little small adjustments to how it looks on the actual post. Woo! I feel like I'm talking like a mad woman. I have had way too much coffee today. Way too much coffee and I've made a lot of videos today. So I feel sorry for y'all. I'm like talking like a mad woman. Anyway, now this is finally saving. It's taking its own sweet precious time as always. Once that gets all done, I'm just going to hit this view post button once it'll let me and then we'll take a peek and see what that looks like on the WordPress page. So once again, this is the easiest and bestest way ever to embed a YouTube video on your WordPress website. It's going to pop it in there, it's going to look great, and it's not going to have any of those pesky little things at the very end telling them to go off into the Neverlands to find someone else to take a look at. So um, all you're going to do after your page pops up is click play, and I'm going to pause myself. 
And then you can hover off the screen and see if you need to make any height or width adjustments for too much black. So I could technically make this a little less tall if I wanted to, but I think it looks just fine like it is. So there you have it. That is how to embed a YouTube video on your WordPress website and center it all at the same time. So if you liked this video today, hop back onto my YouTube channel. You can subscribe. I'm doing a video every single day, Monday through Friday. So this is going to be super fun. Or you can visit me at makingheadway.us to see my latest tutorials. Thanks and have a great day. Bye.